Welcome to Certain Point of View, your first step into a much nerdier world. Be sure to subscribe, rate, and review the podcast on iTunes. Just go to certainpov.com. Thanks. And now your hosts, Ben Milton and Addie Thomas. Hey, Nerdfurters, I'm Addie Thomas. And I am Ben Milton. We're doing another episode of our D20 Star Wars RPG adventure today. Uh, we are joined by Case. We're joined by Corey and Sean today. Uh, before we get to that adventure, though, I want to just remind you, you can always follow the continuing adventures of our weight loss Civil War challenge uh, on our website, certainpov.com. While you're there, don't forget to check out all our social media, subscribe to our email if you want to keep up from any updates from us. Again, all of that is on our website, certainpov.com. Case, go ahead and take it away. All right, so as he said, I am Case. I am your dungeon master. Uh, I am joined uh, to my left by... Hey everyone, I am Hu Flung Dung, Misa Gungan, and uh, I am a soldier, a failed singer, and I love <laughs> long walks on the beach and watching movies. <laughs> Who is <laughs> flying by? And I, uh, I also have a... You're uh, good. A, a, okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, God, Addy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so brutal. I know. He, he was looking. He was searching for material. So yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, it's true. They're keeping it alive. <laughs> I am Fosho. I am a Force Adept. I am a Keldor. Uh, I am uh, the the. I sort of... hear me roar. <laughs> no, I I'm a, a little bit of a Force user, not a lot of a Force user. So go ahead, Ben. Uh, I am Phallus Vash Killer, a human fringer. I have been out on the Outer Rim, making a living just kind of as a loner. All right, and? Hi, I'm Sean. I'm playing the part of Fender <laughs> Pickup. I'm an Anthorian scout who is an excellent pilot. <laughs> on late nights. On the NHS, and I fold on my Very spare well. time, and I'm happy to be here. Thank you. Uh, All right, guys, we'll everyone. Venus on WKRP. Yes. <laughs> Guys, if you would all be so kind as to roll a d20 for me. 10. 13. 14. 14? All right, Ben. So you're the one to do the ben, recap. Ben, you're getting all the recap I got bonus. bad news, guys. <laughs> you don't know what happened. <laughs> you only have to listen to that last episode to know I don't know what happened. All right, here's what I remember. We escaped from the brothel, we're trying to fight our way out. Bad things were happening. Things got confusing. I may or may not have punched you to try and kill you. Oh, may or may have not? I wasn't trying to kill you. I definitely hit you, though. <laughs> uh, and we were uh, kind of, like, boxed in, and then all of a sudden, uh, Reggie showed up and uh, is leading us to our, our way out, I guess. Man, it was a, that was a long episode ago. It's okay. Thank it's you. Okay. That, <laughs> you you are empirically speaking correct. Uh, maybe the specific details can be a little more fleshed out. How but... do you survive as a fringer? <laughs> <laughs> it's just these drunk accounts was... of everything. It's like his his life story is just fear and loathing in Las Vegas. Where <laughs> it's like I'm pretty sure I was fighting Wookies. Maybe they were something else. I don't know. I don't know. I I went, don't know. Guys, guys, I went to this one world. It was a moon of some planet, and there were these tiny Wookies everywhere. It was crazy. And then I found myself. You know, the drugs took hold, and the next thing I knew, I was on a desert world with an actual Wookie. I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. <laughs> a group of five troopers have come up behind you guys and are opening fire. Uh, one just hit your ally. Um, what do you want to do? Because they're coming at you. They're they're about 30 feet away. About 30 feet away. I want to create a diversion so them two can get away. So I'm going to go ahead and um, Corey's use a escape Corey, artist. Everybody's so desperately trying to kill themselves in this game. <laughs> <laughs> He's Jar Jar. I'm on a roll, there. all right? I'm getting high rolls here, so... <laughs> I feel limitless. Wait, sorry. By the way, this is now, this is now a straight up fight. This is no longer a skill challenge. Huh? This is now a straight up fight. They're they're coming at you and shooting yeah, at you. Yeah, no more like, skill challenges. Now you just gotta kill people. Just yeah. Shoot. Roll that die. Roll that die. Sixteen. Total. Total. Okay, you hit. Uh, roll for damage. So that's I believe three d eight. Fourteen. Fourteen. All right. Uh, you you hit one of them. And uh, it, it's, it's clearly hit. It's, its armor takes some of the brunt, so it's not down, but it's been hit. Okay. Uh, 
So you've got five total still rushing at you guys. Uh, Faux show, you're up. Ten. Um, you, you miss. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, damn. Way to go, Stormtrooper. We're gonna we're gonna stay on this fight for the moment. So, uh, Phileas, you're up here. Fifteen. Uh, that's a hit. Uh, so I think your blaster is three d six. Fifteen damage. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, you hit the same one that that Hoof shot at before, and uh, you take it dies. I got you, buddy. Yeah. Where you fail, I succeed. I know. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm so bitter that you made all that loud noise. <laughs> Lay back. I'm gonna make loud. I'm gonna make That's loud love to you. I'm, I'm moving on to Hoof. <laughs> Jar Jar Wick over there. Uh, <laughs> Jar Jar Wick. Yep. <laughs> so uh, they uh, unload a, unload a bevy of, of shots, and uh, the only person that's hit is Phaleas. Oh God damn it! Phaleas takes six points of damage. Uh, vitality or wound? Well, damage. vitality. I have three. Vi- I have three. So, health, so then three it's three vitality. wound points that you're at, or that you lose. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. I'm at eleven. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. okay. Eleven. Okay. All right, so we're back up to the beginning of the order. So, Hoof, uh, they're, they're firing at you. You're down to four. They're, they're shooting at you. Yeah. Is there anything I can use for demolitions? Like, I'm looking around, like, is there anything, like, do I have, I don't have anything, anything. Yeah. I, I'll, according to this, I have a fire extinguisher. I'll, uh, not really on your person. That's, that was in the, you, you grabbed the one that, w- that was used okay. to, like, Just blow up that. the, or to, like, create All the right. safe passage there I'm before. Sure, because. Um, there is a deactivated uh, evaporation arch that they're about to walk through. Uh, I would say you can use demolitions to activate it and try to like go Do crazy it. on it. We're doing um, it. So this is going to be a hard check to make it a lethal to armor kind of uh, kind of use. Okay. Um, but just if you terminals. make it, uh, you'll get two of them as they're like crossing through it. Boom. All right. So two twenty. Yep. <laughs> Best roll yet. I got a one. Oh no. <laughs> It's my demolition, so it's a uh, four. No, right. demolition you five, six. It's, I got six. Now, uh, so you, you try to like patch into the panel, and nothing really happens. You just sort of like pressing buttons, uh, <laughs> and, and unfortunately, that was your turn. Yeah. Uh, the result. Jesus uh, Christ. Fo, you're right. you're up again. Roll. Get him, killer. Uh, yeah, I'll take another shot. So two of these guys have just walked through a deactivated evaporation gate. Uh, which is what he was trying to work on. The other two are about to cross through it. Okay. 20. And you're taking a shot? Yeah. Okay, that was at with disadvantage, right? Yes. Okay, really? Okay, cool. So yeah, you hit you hit one of the two that's uh, up front. Uh, so give me a damage roll. I believe it's 3d6. Nine, all right. Uh, you hit it. It's it, Again, his armor soak up, soaks up some of the damage. You're the only person who can hit a stormtrooper in the armor, and it doesn't kill him. Uh, he he already hit. The only reason you killed him is that he was already hit pretty bad by uh, before. Teamwork <laughs> makes the dream work. Once again, I gotta finish the job for you. Okay, right. yeah, so you can target the same one. Seven. Seven total. Mm-hmm. Your shot goes wild like a stormtrooper shot. Uh, all right, they're up now. I'm not proud of that. More of a gambler than a <laughs> Yeah, you're also the kind of guy who runs up to a turret on Gavin and uses computer use instead of shooting it. Potato, potato. I didn't <laughs> have shooting skill. <laughs> Oof. You take I'm a, a shot. Lover, not a I take a shot. All right, sure. Uh, shot you, of what? You take eight points of vitality damage. Shh, let it happen. Let it happen. Go to the light. Okay, I'm at four vitality points. Man, where is that clone when we need him? <laughs> All right, and uh, we're we're back up to the top of the order. Hoof, you're up. Uh, you can either shoot at them. You can try to do the demolitions thing again. They're uh, uh, there's the last two are walking through. Demolitions. I got it. What do you get? Ten total. A ten total. Uh, no, unfortunately, it does not work. Failed again. So you're working on it. <laughs> You successfully turned it on, but you didn't turn it on at any sort of setting that would have been, been outside of its safety protocols to make it lethal to someone that was a human in armor. Victory is mine! Uh, Let's get it. Not today, it's not. So we're back, we're back to foe. The, there's a wounded stormtrooper and three healthy ones coming at you guys. You can do it! I'm taking a, a shot at another one, at one of the healthy ones. 
Patty sacrifice. I wanted the healthy ones. Your magic. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, God, no. <laughs> oh no! What? Oh no! What? What? Roll that again. You just killed me. You just killed me. Roll that again. Oh no! I want to live. Twenty. Oh no! Okay. Cricket. So you just miss. <laughs> you fire off a shot and you just miss. <sighs> Failius, you're up. Oh my God, Annie. Ten. Eleven. I know, right? Kill 11 yeah. total, you miss. Wow, we are amazing. <laughs> You've had more fails than me today. Don't, touch, don't say we. <laughs> I worked an amazing delusion out. I got some force lightning today, and I got some, uh, I crushed some stormtroopers. Fantastic. You take another shot. Nice. Uh, shot what? You take 11 points of damage. Oh, snap. Oh. Hoof be dead. No, hoof is at two wounds. A two wounds? You said 11? Yeah. A three wounds and a three. Hoof almost. So that shot hits you and you're like, <laughs> you're that, that like got you in the stomach and you're like, you're feeling it right there. Like, uh, This is nutsin'. <laughs> Gonna nutsin' on you. Really? I don't know. <laughs> I to do that. It's like thinking of the Wookiee. Yeah. <laughs> you can't get that Wookiee out of his head. He just oh, wants to go up. back. That's why he wants to kill us all here. That's a sexy fucking Wookiee. <laughs> oh no! Sorry, hoof you're up. You're, that was that was you getting hit. But it's your turn. Uh, so they're clear of that gate. So you can't really you can't, do the demolition trick anymore. Demolitions anymore. Uh, what if I can intimidate them with my three wounds? <laughs> I would say I would recommend you just try to shoot the one that was already wounded. Let's at least, just like, shoot the one that's already try wounded. To, let's just try to kill somebody, buddy. That's all, this is pretty it's like fancy right at now. this point. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Let's just try to kill thinking somebody. of his failed singing career. <laughs> He's having flashbacks now. <laughs> oh. No! no. no. <laughs> Why do you no. think about your career? <laughs> uh, thinking about your career is always a critical fail. 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 You don't focus uh, on your failures. Roll that yeah. again. I'm, I'm rolling it again, and you I'm get, thinking of victory. <laughs> thinking of victory. This is how Addy dies. <laughs> Six. Total? Um, yeah. Well, pl yeah, seven total. This Wait, there's I... no way that's your... Hold on. You rolled a six just now? Yeah. Oh, no. You guys should name this episode, Remember the Atoll. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? I think it's going to have to be. <laughs> uh, that's an 11. That is just enough to not hit anyone <laughs> if you were shooting at the one that was already wounded. Are you guys all about to die? Sweet. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> cool. we are. Yeah, we are. Oh. If we could get on comms with Bendy and tell him to remember us. <laughs> Save yourself! Out. Save, Save yourself! Bo, you're up. As he slowly flies away from you. That's when we die from space. With, <laughs> like, with crisp, clean, folded towels. And this, and they're like, oh, well, this guy's not even trying to run. He must like, be okay. Yeah. <laughs> and let him go. He's clearly not a rebel. He's not even trying to run. <laughs> Well, this guy really embodies flying casually. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're up. Um, Make magic happen, Addy. I can take Save another shot. Save us, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're our only hope. Well, no, you know what? I'm going to do something a little bit more dramatic. Oh, no. I'm going to do another move object and uh, try to bring like the, cord the, the corridor down on the uh, stormtroopers. Okay. 16. All right. As with before, you're able to sort of rotate the axis of gravity for them, and so they all slip back, and they like slot, like they're all like scratching, uh, crawling at the uh, at the floor, which is now the, like their wall as they slide down. Um, they are able to fall through. The one that was hit before goes through the evaporation field and actually seems to pass out and falls all the way. The other two are able to catch themselves. Or pardon me, the other three are able to catch themselves. They're now a decent way away, but they're they're at like um, pretty much as far as you can easily see. Uh, but they're they seem to be like righting themselves and like getting up. But the uh, the one that was unconscious or is now unconscious is probably dead. Nice. Nice. Uh, but you're feeling really weak. Yeah. <laughs> So. You, anything will, will probably push you over the edge on that one and knock yeah. you out. Phileas, you're up. I am going to run at them and attack and fire at them. Okay. And yell at these two to run to the get to the ship. 
And I'm going to use my heroic surge so I can do an additional attack. Sure. All right, so you're getting two attacks. Yes. Cool. Seven. Okay, so you miss. Eight. 20. Roll it again. 17. Roll your damage. You hit one of them. Give me a six. Eight. Eight total? Yeah. Okay. Uh, you hit you hit the guy, and he seems to be hit pretty hard. Okay. You better run. <laughs> you better run. Uh, okay. Uh, so you get the, you get that shot off, and it, it's hit pretty damn hard. Um, its armor seems to be the thing that prevented it from just being completely blown away by that shot. When did stormtroopers get armor that actually helped them? Uh, the nature of the rules of this game is that armor does a little bit of help. It's not a lot, but a little bit of help. Man. Princess Leia must have been a hell of a shot. Yes, yes she was. I'll tell you this, she wasn't level three. <laughs> True. Fair enough. All right, uh, a, a hail of fire comes past, but it, it all seemed to miss. Uh, and then you guys hear a uh, pitter-patter of feet um, as a bunch of Nemoidian battle droids uh, come round the corner. Uh, it's about five of them, and they all uh, position uh, guns, they, they form a straight line across. Um, they all raise their guns and then they sort of shift over into like weird positions where the gunshots exactly whiz right by you as if a computer had specifically targeted them not to hit you uh, and hit the stormtroopers. Uh, the nice. one band that you had hit before goes down dead. So, uh, there's two left, and they're uh, they're firing off, or they're they're sort of readying themselves. Uh, so now we've got these uh, the droids are now like laying waste as well. Uh, who for back up to you? I'm gonna use hide. I said run, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, if you want to try to hide... No, I'm not hiding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't sacrifice myself so you can hide. <laughs> oh, Get to the goddamn shit. sacrificed yourself. <laughs> Got one out of two shots. Let's calm down. <laughs> I did the best I could. Yeah. He's now noticeably closer to that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And definitely the target of the last two. Maybe I should use diplomacy and see if I can talk no, to the No, you should run! Last two. You should run! <laughs> 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 All right, we're... Well, I guess we're going to be running then. It, no yes. way, you run. Uh, I'm running yeah, too. You're running Thank too, you. yeah. Thank you for listening. So, uh, let's I'm trying run to run earlier. Where we need <laughs> to go. Me. Okay. So, what do I need to roll? So, you're just, run so you're just running? Yeah, we're just. Okay, you're just moving your speed. I'm going to uh, use escape artist. So, with you running that speed, you're basically. Uh, you're almost to where the, droid the line of droids are uh, on your turn. Okay. Okay, so, uh, Fosho, you're up. You're up, buddy. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, I'm, I'm going to continue running, so I guess... So you're silently. also going to sort of move and... Okay, yeah. so you guys almost make it to the droids for the in your turn. Um, Phalius, yep. you are up at the moment. Awesome. I'm going to attack. Okay. 15. Cool. All right, that's a hit. Give it a shot. Six. 12. All right, you kill one of the stormtroopers. Yeah! Uh, one's left, and the uh, he tries to fire at you, and he misses. <laughs> uh, and the battle droids uh, all sort of position themselves. They like shift back and forth a little bit to get into the right spot, and then they all like line off their shots and uh, kill the remaining uh, stormtrooper. Uh, I'm the and best. you, their right. their eyes flicker, and uh, you hear Not Reggie's voice come over. It's like. I thought I told you guys to run. I'll see you at the dock. Roger, Roger. Roger, Roger. <laughs> Drink. Sure. Oh, <laughs> we come to the point of killing battle droids. <laughs> battle droids just saved us. Yeah, not those ones. The night, the cool ones. <laughs> that was embarrassing. <laughs> That was not a great fight, guys. We nope. got a lot of work to so do. So you guys, are, you guys are all hurt, and, and as you are, are on your run, like n none of you are in great shape. You're all like kind of limping away. Um, however, you're, you're getting pretty familiar. close to it. In fact, through the sensors, you can uh, Fendir, you can tell that they're actually about to run around the corner. Like you can, uh, the the radar sort of indicates 
uh, some particularly Gungan light shapes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> some particular Gungan. Almost around the corner there. Uh, <laughs> taking a lot of damage, Addy. <laughs> so I'm taking so much damage, I look like a Gungan now. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so you uh, do you activate the guns? You, you still have like all those uh, troopers locked on. Yep. All right, so you uh, you the Susan lays waste to the troopers that are right at the <laughs> at bad. the door there, um, and so when the they come around the corner, there's no troopers right there. There's still a bunch around, and you and the loading dock doors are open, and you can see out into space. There's those Death Stars, but they don't know actually what's going on in the loading dock. Um, but all these stormtroopers kind of like stop and turn and look at uh, at you guys as you come out uh, because you know all the gunshots and everything drew, drew their attention. Um, <laughs> this is gonna end badly. All right. When Reggie steps out this from another like corridor, the final glory, guys. <laughs> hold on, with, with his uh, heavy blaster drawn, and he's like popping off stormtroopers as he's walking out. Uh, and uh, I guess he's really firing with his left hand. Uh, with his right hand, he's like tapping it, and uh, all these like service droids that were like kind of deactivated rise up and start uh, nice. attacking Imperials. So most of them are actually now being grappled by uh, by service droids. Like he's he's commandeered all the ones that are around you. Uh, so you have an open access way to get like mo- or to the ship. Run! All right, so you run through. So Finder, what are you doing with as they're running? Get to the Susan. Well, I think I'm still fine. Well, I'm taking heavy fire, but I'm also going to start firing at all the targets I had locked. Okay, you you start laying with the ones that you that you did not already have locked down are being grappled by uh, ba- like by repurposed battle droids. As uh, Reggie is firing off and picking off some of them, they're trying to get to you, and you have your shield raised. Let's drop those shields. Okay, let's drop those shields. Okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so that would have been a really funny boop. <laughs> <laughs> Drop those shields like a pair of panties. <laughs> We're coming aboard. All right, you guys get on board. Uh, when you see outside of the airlock, a uh, a Tie Fighter rises up into your field of view. Oh, that's oh, a, that's on the trailer. It's not in the actual. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the actual uh, that does deserve a trailer. Tight surgery. <laughs> no. It's still a lot of rum. <laughs> <laughs> a blaster shot from the TIE Fighter er, comes in uh, and uh, hits the ship. It also takes out a bunch of stormtroopers. It, like, uh, it's such a, a large impact. Um, your, your ship is hit, so you're probably going to want to raise the shields, um, but it's still functional right now. Uh, board, right? You, you, every one of you except for Reggie. No, Reggie. We're away from Reggie, right? Uh, <laughs> is he, is he making Who raised his the shields? <laughs> did he say raise the shields? Fender, did uh, you raise the shields? He hasn't actually raised the shields yet. Though. He has the choice to raise the shields. But, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Reggie taps on his right hand, and uh, a, you guys see this uh, this uh, red sphere rush over to him, and a Jordica. The, uh, the like the the battle or like the the destroyer right. droids yeah, yeah. The uh, flips into position right in front of him uh, and he grabs hold of it and it start or it uh, it leaps back into its like uh, uh, its ball form and starts rushing as he's being dragged he has his right foot like on the ground so that the, his back body is not getting like dragged by it but sparks are coming off of his mechanical foot um, and it's a uh, blue shields uh, uh, circle up around it, uh, and then as it's, it starts to gain speed, those shields turn red, uh, and it, uh, you get a calm message over it being like, get ready to go, get ready to go! Uh, and the droidica drags Reggie through the airlock sh- uh, force shields, and uh, the red shield of the droidica slams into the force shield of this TIE fighter. The one shield? <laughs> Force shield of Force this Force shield? Fighter. Yes. Force shield? Yes. Because TIE Fighters don't have shields. Uh, no. Curiously, this TIE Fighter appears to have a shield. Are we retconning it's a, TIE it's Fighters? It's a modified TIE Fighter. Hold on. Modified TIE Fighters Hold have on. shields. <laughs> Darth um, Vader's the only one who had a no, modified no, TIE Fighter. No, he is actually he not. Yeah. He's 100% not the only one who did. Yeah. He's just the first who didn't. <laughs> and curiously, this... Uh, 
So, this Droidica, uh, the, the red shields of it burns through the force shield around the TIE Fighter, and it slams into the cockpit window. Uh, into the pilot, and then You Reggie... just killed Darth Vader? <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> and then you see it uh, get sucked back out into space, and the, uh, the Droidica expands to sort of catch everything and uh, to block it off completely. So you have no idea what's going on inside of that TIE Fighter, but all of a sudden it just like sort of like shifts around erratically, uh, and then begins uh, firing off indiscriminately, but before it spins around and starts uh, flying away completely. Okay. And a comm message goes, move you idiots, move! Let's move. I guess dance. I don't know what else it does. <laughs> You're the pilot. <laughs> so, Fender, let's get a pilot check going to to get you out of there. Just, oh lord! Just, this cable, man. <laughs> so who set this crap up? Over the comm, you hear it's like I've taken over this tie, but I can't see. I had to take out the cockpit. My droidica's keeping in the atmosphere. Fifteen. Tell me what to shoot. No. Yeah. Fifteen. Not us. <laughs> Is it, uh, where, where is he? He's turned around, right? He, yeah, he's turned. He's turned away from the away from, from the ship. Uh, is there uh, anything other than with the that pilot out there? check, or with that pilot check, you're able to get the the ship get able to get Susan leaving the airlock. Uh, as you're coming out, you see in the distance there's these star destroyers, but they're not like right on top of you. Um, and there are Tie Fighters all kind of like swirling around. Um, you. Let's get um, so, someone take navigation and figure out what way you need to face the it's Tie Fighter the if it's going to fire right? off yeah, on anyone. It's so it's not gate. not pilot. Astro Gate, right? Yeah. <laughs> but the court's full of here. Legend. Twenty. All right, you're, you uh, you relay com uh, commands over uh, the comm to Reggie, uh, and he like is able to be directed off towards where like TIE Fighters are coming. He's just firing off indiscriminately, but his shots actually do hit one or two of them. Um, you see more TIE Fighters coming at you as you're still trying to get fully clear of the space station. Um, give me another, or give me another pilot check to, to avoid any incoming fire. 25. All right, so yeah, you're, you're able to start pulling out. Uh, TIE Fighters are coming on you, like, let's get another nav check to figure out, like, where it needs to be aiming. Guys, I just pulled out and TIE Fighters are coming on me. Eight. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay. No! I heard you talking, I thought you just wanted to be caught up. Uh, it starts flying forward and is completely Thank missing everything. Uh, Reggie, get back to us. You're not gonna make it out there. We need a distraction. Point me in the right direction. You're in the right direction. Get back to this ship. Uh, Findir, get a get a pilot check to figure out what direction you need to be facing to go into hyperspace. No, Fendir, go back for Reggie. 26. If you guys are ready, at it. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Someone tell me which way to face. <laughs> That's what she said. Tell where to face. Phileas, give me another check. 15. All right. The TIE Fighter starts flying towards the oncoming squadron of TIE Fighters, and it's, it's firing off shots in every given direction. No, Reggie! Uh, as they're starting to swarm along it, uh, shots being fired and hitting its force shields. It doesn't have shields! <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, I want an apology! <laughs> Not a retcon! <laughs> Not getting it. Uh, it explodes. No! And takes six TIE Fighters with it. Because it clearly doesn't have shields. Uh, it, you see, as the explosion, uh, the explosion starts to push into the blue halo of the shields around these TIE Fighters before puncturing through and destroying them as well. Because they don't have shields. Um, everyone give me spot checks. You can see that they don't have shields. I got 25, so I can clearly see the TIE Fighters don't have shields. <laughs> yeah. 25, I see a shield. Uh, <laughs> you see a figure in white hold, holding on very closely to a red fire extinguisher that he's cut the head off. <laughs> <laughs> and it, the, uh, the exhaust... Is he uh, pulling towards <laughs> us? 
is sending him towards you guys. And you see, and you see Reggie. Give me a piloting Watch check to get in position for a Yes! <laughs> 17. You, you move into position for him to, to get to your loading dock, or into your like your airlock doors, uh, and he comes on board. Uh, we lost J. Mike. <laughs> and the fire extinguishers win again. Oh. Oh. Give me one more pilot check to get out of there before God, they uh, they review. You better roll a twenty. Hey. Or not. Ten. <laughs> Just flew us right into a. Uh, you're, you're able to start moving out. Uh, unfortunately, uh, shots are coming down. Um, with your shields up, you've got three more shots left in you before the ship is destroyed and the shield, or like before the shots go through the shield and you're taken out. Um, a group of TIE fighters are now swarming at you guys uh, because you took the time to pick up uh, Reggie. I'm going to go slow. Uh, give me another pilot check real quick. Come on, 20. Come on, 20. 14. Okay, you're. This is his modifier. <laughs> it was his modifier. No, oh. no but that's sufficient. That's you got. Uh, you're able to take off. Um, you don't have a, a clear lock, but you do at least have a lock into open space. There you go. See. Go uh, speed racer. Gl glass half full. <laughs> glass half full. Here we go. All right. the the path that you were going to is going to take you to clear open space, but it, and it's only going to be a two hour jump, uh, and hopefully they weren't able to immediately lock on to you guys. Uh, with that twenty four, as you're sort of like, I'll say that was That's you right. being able to get away without them like locking on to you. Okay. All right. So and you guys have gotten clear. Clone. Fuck your Wookie. <laughs> so it's only going to be a couple hours in space. It's not going to be as long as the last trip. I got what I, I wanted. I swear to one, one day to come back and get for your wookie. <laughs> I was hoping to save that droid. Thank you. I think we... <laughs> thank you, That's sir. why I gave you the bag. I wanted it on the ship. I'm sorry, but <laughs> we were using it to get out. He's and as then clumsy as he's stupid. The <laughs> drink. <laughs> Foe went down. down. Bahama mama. Well... I didn't have a choice. I can't I'm sorry. fault you guys. You didn't come back for me. Well, we couldn't leave you there. You saved our our bacon twice, three times. Three a times. A lady. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, guys, I was trying to tell you that the Empire showed up, and you oh. need to get back to the ship. Yeah. Oh, hey, so, thanks. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Keep us posted. Didn't even notice. <laughs> so, Ithorian. Bender, right? Yes, Bendir. Uh, <laughs> Bendir over. We're not giving our real names out. No, we're still not. We still <laughs> haven't given them our well. real names. Yeah, Bendir, but he's kind of with us where on are, our ship. Where are we me? going? Open space. Open space. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Should we head to the Reggie, is it I've got for, some news. Is it safe to... for you to go back to... No. If the Imperials... Fossa knew I had to be the one to get you out of here. Because if... If the Imperials question me, guys, I, I have some news for you. I, I'm a clone. Wait, what? <laughs> I, Great I, I was a clone God trooper in the Clone Wars. Wow. And unfortunately, if if I were to be questioned by any Imperial soldiers or anything, I, I would have no choice but to divulge the information. Well, I have news for you too. That's n the names we gave you are fake. I gathered. <laughs> my real name is Steve Rogers. <laughs> and my real name is Wang Too Fat. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that sounds right. We <laughs> <laughs> just saved our lives, guys. <laughs> but. Why are we lying to him? So. I was one of the Captain America. <laughs> Fossa gave me some. a big way. <laughs> <laughs> we all have dreams. <laughs> yeah, I want a cookie. Look, Fossa gave me some important information. We need to get this back to the rebels. If you know how we can get back to them. Apparently, the Death Star was just the tip of the iceberg. I knew it! I knew it! Um, 
I, I'd be Thanks, happy Steve. to pass that information on, Steve. <laughs> Thank you. Let's get you where you can, because I knew there was something more than the Death Star. Um, you know, Reggie, for a clone, you're not very funny, and your shoes aren't very big. That's well, a clown. That's oh, a clown. Oh, yeah, there. <laughs> God oh. damn it. <laughs> uh, on that note, I might need some assistance I, with a new shoe. My... My leg seems to be kind of banged up from that uh, that escape attempt. Uh, oh. If any of you are any good with repair, ooh, uh, ooh. I could use some work on that. I got a six on repair. Anybody can beat that? Negative. Not me. I'll help you out, Reg. You're, okay. my, you're my boy, Blue. So while you guys are traveling, you, you spend some time working on that, uh, like trying to fix his leg. So it's cut off from below the knee, and yep. what it is, it's, it is like a, a hydraulic like shaft that extends yeah. um, that he can use for like jumping and for like kicking things really hard. Uh-huh. Um, you guys actually, because of that intimidate check, you did a really good job and prevented it. Uh, him from using it in combat, which I was really excited to use, but that was a really good intimidate check. So, what are you gonna do? Yeah, exactly. Rolls are rolls. Um, so you're, you're working on his leg, and uh, you guys are all traveling until you get to the the safe point. Anything else you guys do in this like uh, like two or three hour window? I'm at three wound. I mean, can I do anything to heal myself or like? Yeah, like we're all pretty banged up. What yeah, I mean, you guys can uh, try to use some med packs. Um, How many well, med packs do we have um, left? Treat wound, whatever. I would say, well, treat wound kind of works in conjunction with med packs in this in this setting because I think so, we only have two uh, left yeah we only have two I would say you left. can use one because you're not under duress in this time so you're not like uh, like you're not like quickly using all the materials at once so I'd say you can use one to sort of get you guys all back up at least to full wounds and once you guys have rested you'll be back up your vitality points but we're in an interesting spot guys we're, we're we need you to get well, us to the to the rest of the rebels but to the rendezvous to the hoth yeah we gotta go to Hoth, right? No, there's where's another the, rendezvous Where's the rendezvous point? point? Uh, the rendezvous point, you remember, is Argonar. Oh, yeah, Argonar. Yeah. Mm. Good old Argonar. Uh, Let's go to Hoth. <laughs> All right, we'll go to Argonar. I'm sorry, where's Hoth? I don't, I don't know what he knows. <laughs> I've never heard of this it's planet. It's on the wrong side of the galaxy. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure no one knows about this planet at this point in time. Argonar's rendezvous point. That's where we'll find the rebels where you can pass on your information, Reggie. All right, let's let's get there. Let's get there. Um, That's when there's a rotten egg. <laughs> All right, and you guys, uh, when so you reposition yeah. your uh, your lights or faster than light jump once you come out of the the past one. So you, it, it's going to take you a little bit of time. So we're going to say that it's going to be about an hour to like calculate and and get the right trajectory, and then it's going going to be about a ten hour trip. Uh, is there anything else you guys want to do in this time? So you've got a, a chunk of time. Finn Deer is going to be mostly occupied during these like middle chunks, so he's not going to be able to really get a full rest in there. Uh, but he, he would be Wait, able to... He's the one to... who's scared of hyperdrive, though, right? Like, has he overcome his fear of hyperdrive? Uh, at the very least, clearly in the frenzy of trying to get yeah, free, he, he got you out of there on that small it. jump. And he's going to have to at least be like working on it <clears> to like direct you into hy hyperjump the next time. Or hyperdrive the next time, um, but once you guys are in hyperdrive, he'll be okay. It's just he's very tense. <laughs> you need a back rub, buddy. Yeah, if you don't mind, that'd be great. All right, yeah. get get that shaved hey. Wookie over here. I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> shaved so, Wookie. So for the most part, you guys are recuperating and you're just yeah. you're just trying to relax. Just it's a, it's really up. small quarters. It's not like yeah. you can do a whole lot. Like you you work on his foot. Probably by the end of the ten hour stretch, you've gotten his foot kind of back in position so he can at least walk. Okay. Because he was not able to prior to that. Um, and as you guys are coming out of hyperdrive uh, at Argonar, uh, you come out of it to see a battle going on. Oh, That's uh, because the Empire is there. Out of the fire, dot, dot, dot. And that's where we're going to end the session. God <laughs> damn. Bah, bah. Every time. I know, right? Like we're just right out of it. Right back in the midst, middle of all of it. You can follow the rest of the Star Wars D20 episodes on our website, certainpov.com. Uh, be sure to check out the Weight Loss Civil War and our social media, all of that again, certainpov.com. And until next week, stay scruffy, my nerf herders. Thanks for listening to Certain Point of View. Don't miss an episode. Just subscribe, rate, and review the podcast on iTunes. Head over to certainpov.com.